This afternoon, we are diving into the world of celebrity news, but with a twist. There's been a lot of buzz about Ben Affleck and Jennifer Lopez's relationship lately. Reporters dissect their every move and social media explodes with analysis of the fam famous couple. Blanca Cobb is here to talk about shifting the focus on kindness, not speculation. Uh, speculation, excuse me. Blanca, what do people misunderstand about kindness? A lot of times people think of kindness as something that you do or say when you're face to face with someone or you're on the telephone or you're texting. But kindness is more than a smile or opening the door for someone. Sure, those are wonderful acts of kindness. It's offering support, listening to somebody, but it goes beyond that because you wanna be kind to somebody even when you're not face to face, even when you aren't actively communicating with them in the moment. Hmm. And what are ways to be kind to people that they might not even know about? This is where you protect their privacy or confidentiality, something that they have told you that is important to them, that they are sharing with you. You're being kind to them, even if they're not around, by not sharing it, by protecting the information that they told you. That's respect that you're showing when they're not around. If other people are talking about them, People are gossiping, people are confused or have these burning questions about what's going on in somebody's life. If you have that information or even if you don't, this is where you don't participate. So this is how you can be kind to somebody and they're not even around and they may not ever know what you've done, but kindness just expands more than something you do for somebody in the moment when you're face to face. Yeah, absolutely. And why is it so important to be kind? because kindness is contagious. There is this chain reaction. Think about when somebody smiles at you, you smile back, or you smile at someone and you notice that they're smiling at you. This is, this is where this kindness shows that you care. You're showing that you care about somebody. But the, the better thing is that it generates this positive cycle of positivity, which is what we need in our lives. Our world and our communities meet, need more kindness. So just imagine if there was something that you could do every day or a couple times a day to show a little kindness to somebody else, it's gonna be like this domino effect because it is contagious. Someone feels good and they spread and share that kindness to somebody else. Absolutely, Blanca, thank you so much. You can continue the conversation with Blanca on her Facebook page, Blanca Cobb, body language expert. We'll be right back.